Hey guys, this is Rossi coming to you with my first tutorial on how to do the spring scope transition. Um, yeah, so this is what it's gonna look like. Now, Okay, so knowing that, let's get started. So I have my two clips that I'm gonna bring in. And on the second clip, you wanna, you want the second clip to be the one that you want the scope to be in. And you wanna find the spot where his scope is in. And you wanna make sure the, the preview quality is best full. And you wanna take a snapshot of it. And just drag that all the way over there. And now you wanna drag the image in on top of the clip. And now, so you have that over that clip. And now you want to go to mask. And I already have a one set up. But you just want to mask around the scope. And I don't really like the way that it's set up right there with the black around it. I'm just going to do the feather type to make it look better. Mm, I kind of like that. Now you want to go to position and go all the way to the end and do full 360 around it. And you want to go over there and make sure the angle is at negative 360. And I don't know if you could see this, but I'm going to make sure that preview is on. And it should spin. And so yeah, it's just spinning right now. Now you kind of want it to fade in a little bit. Just do that. Now you want to do the transition part. To make it like come out, you want to go to zoom and center and zoom. And another cool one is 3D flying out, the default one. Yeah, but I'm using the zoom one. And see, now it should just fly in pretty much and if you could hear that that was my brother getting mad over xbox i don't know if he could or not but yeah so now it should just fly in spinning all right knowing that you want to click the video control c control v and you want to bring that second clip down and you want to drag it in over that one and delete the transition you just want to drag it in. And this should just make it to where it, like, fits in better. Yeah, I don't know if you could see that or not. No, I'm going to drag this more over there. Um, yeah. Wait, I don't think that is right. No. I didn't do that right. And so now it should fit to the 360 now. I don't know why it did that, but... I guess I'm the retarded one. Okay, now you just want to drag this in, and the effect should happen. Then it should just go along with the video. So yeah, thank you for watching this um, tutorial, guys. And, uh, render this out and put it at the end of the video just to see to show you guys what it looked like and um yeah thanks for watching and i just made a twitter guys so if any of you guys would want to follow it i'll put that into, in the description so thanks for watching please subscribe bye Oh, Jesus Christ. Hey. Now.